And um, before I tell you my poem, I just want to share with you, besides the fact that I'm an artist, one of the things that unite my poetry and my art is the fact that I'm Puerto Rican. And I'm 100% Puerto Rican on my mother's side and my father's side, but you'd be surprised how many people tell me that I'm not because I'm black. And you'd be surprised how many people tell me that I'm not, even in my own family, when I say I'm black, they're like, no, you're not, you're Puerto Rican. So I wanted to share, especially here in this Black History Month, that 27% of the people that live on the island of Puerto Rico have African blood in them. 107 years before the, the pilgrims landed on Plymouth Rock, there was slavery on the island of Puerto Rico. So when I say I'm black, I mean I'm African. And that's part of my poetry and it's part of my art. So I'm just going to show you real quick some of the stuff because you'll see that my, poet, my art has different colors. And, and it's to represent not just Puerto Ricans, but all women. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. So this unfinished piece here is called La Madre de mi Cultura. And the poem I'm about to do first is called Preciosa. Yo soy la hija de la hija de la hija del mar, y preciosa le llaman a ella, y preciosa me llaman a mí. You see, I am the daughter of the daughter of the daughter of the sea, and precious they call her, and precious they call me. I was born a tainted seed, although both my parents were married, I was the colored baby my grandmother didn't expect. While my other grandmother wept because I carried a name she believed for her a life of shame. So in my youth, I believed this truth and carried on my shoulders the weight of self-hate and disgrace, always misstepping, never knowing my rightful place. But pero yo soy la hija de la hija de la hija del mal. Y preciosa le llaman a mí, a ella, y preciosa me llaman a mí. So best believe, I learned about my family tree, about Africa and kings and queens and Africa and me, and the faith of a mustard seed made up for the things that I thought I lacked. And in time, I learned that the tiniest seed was black. All right. Ooh.